Hi YouTubers, it's Roadog28 back for another video. Today I am going to be doing a vinyl slash CD update collection haul uh, and showing you some of the stuff that I bought recently as well as some of the stuff that uh, I haven't shown to you. So um, without further ado, let's get started. So first off, starting with the vinyl, um, I picked this one up about a couple of months ago um, and it is Kate Bush 7 inch of Running Up That Hill. Um, I started getting really quite into Kate Bush recently and um, I think this is one of the most well known um, iconic songs that she's done. Um, I'm a really big fan of this song as well as others like Wuthering Heights and um, another one, um, The Big Sky. So I think she's just a really cool, amazing female artist um, and yeah, she's really good. Uh, the second 7 inch that I picked up at the same time as Kate Bush um, was one of my favourite Queen songs. This is a, a 7 inch vinyl of um, Innuendo, which I was really surprised to find in the record sh shop that I was in because I wasn't sure if they ever even did this one. Um, but yeah, it's one of my favourite Queen songs as I said. It's, it's got a really good guitar um, breakdown in the middle, um, mid middle 8 and um, I just really love the lyrics in it and it's just a really beautiful song and I think it means a lot to me because I've been a really big Queen fan for a long time. So um, yeah, that's Queen in you and uh, The third 7 inch that I have, I bought this about, I think it last year at some point, um, and it is uh, the 7 inch edition of Years and Years Shine, which I think has a really cool cover. They always come up with really kind of colourful um, sleeves and covers I think years and years do. Um, I've seen them live a couple of times. Um, it's also got a, a remix rework of Shine on, on it here as well. So um, yeah, that's another one I picked up. Uh, another 7 inch that I was surprised to find in my local record store, which is now sadly shut, um, is um, from Marina and Diamond's Fruit uh, box set collection and it is um, better than that and can't pin me down from the fruit box set, the scratch and sniff one um, and it's really bright and it's like the cherry, the cherry colour, cherry picture as you can see. Um, I really like getting 7 inches, I think they play really easily on vinyl and on a record um, and I, I saw this and I picked it up because I'm a massive Marina fan and I, I thought why not, so yeah, that's Marina the Diamonds, better than that and can't pin me down. Um, the next few vinyls uh, are from an artist that has recently passed away um, and he's such an iconic artist and I think he'll be greatly missed by a lot of music fans in the world um, and it's one of his best songs in my opinion, his most um, memorable. Um, and it is a 7 inch Prince and the Revolution Let's Go Crazy. I love this song so much, like uh, it's in it's in the um it's in the film Purple Rain that he made and uh, it's just incredible. It's so upbeat and it's so uplifting and makes you feel really happy and literally it does what it says on on the front. It's just you can just go crazy dancing to it and it's just like makes you feel really good and he'll be an artist that forever will be just incredible and greatly missed. So um, that's Prince Let's Go Crazy, there's the back as well. It's really incredible listening to on vinyl, it really is. Um, the second one is also by Prince and this is a, a Prince and the Revolution the extended version of Kiss, which is another really, really amazing song. Um, it's got so much funk style in it, and oh, it's just like it's so stylish, and like he's just so sexy on the cover. His fashion was always so out there. Like likewise with David Bowie, I think both of them are sort of in the same boat in terms of style and like futuristic music and wanting to push boundaries. Um, and I think this was another song that that really went there and it's just beautiful, it's such a beautiful cover and back and it's just really is. He's just an, another artist that 
will be really, really greatly missed by many. So that's Prince. Okay, the next um, vinyl that I picked up is a 10 inch uh, vinyl of one of my favorite artists um, that I didn't manage to pick up on record store day because I wasn't able to go. But I went the following week to my record store to see if they still had it and luckily they did. Um, it is Florence and the Machines record store day uh, edition of Delilah and also um, an unreleased Only Love Can Break Your Heart. Um, I really love the front cover of this, like, she, I think she's got this um, design tattooed on her arm, um, Too Fast for Freedom, and yeah, this is just a really great sample of what's on her album already, how big, how blue, how beautiful, um, so yeah, that's Florence and the Machine, Delilah, the record store day version. Um, another, the next final that I have is from an artist that I went to see recently with my friend Charlie and that is Grimes um, I already have her her latest album Art Angels which is amazing I really love it I decided after seeing her this time around to um, get her debut which is uh, Giddy Primes which is a really ethereal way different to her, like her most recent material it's really sort of lo-fi kind of dark music um, that from when she started out doing stuff with synthesizers and stuff um, which is it's really cool actually it's an amazing album to listen to especially on a record player where you can really sort of hear the sort of dark grungy dirty sort of sound and um, yeah and it's really good I really love Grimes and her, her artistry and her art in general is just really profound as you can see so yeah that's Grimes, Geddy Primes. Um, the next one I just quickly show you, just because I already have it and I think I've already shown it to you, um, especially in like C in CD form. It's Florence and the Machines album, How Blue, How Big, How Blue, How Beautiful. Oh, sorry. Um, I already got this on CD. It's one of my albums of 2015. Um, I got this recently just because I wanted to have it on vinyl. I haven't really opened it yet because I've not listened to it on vinyl, which is a kind of bad, but it's a gatefold album, um, so I'm sure it'll be really beautiful to listen to eventually. Um, this is a really solid, great album again from Florence, and you know, I'm really happy about how well she's doing. So yeah, it's Florence and the Machine. Okay, so that's the vinyl over and done with. Um, I've got two CDs, I think, two or three CDs. So um, get them. So this CD is Haim or Haim. Um, I got this a while ago. I'm not sure if I've shown it to you, but um, this is a really great girl group who sort of do sort of grungy, rocky pop sort of music. This is their debut album, Days Are Gone. Um, I really love their um, the remix that they've done recently with. Uh, Calvin Harris, I think it's really really cool and I love sort of that dancey vibe that they have. Um, so that's Heim, Days Are Gone. Um, and the last CD that I have to show you is uh, an, a band that have come up really well in the past year. I think they won an uh, album of the year at the Mercury Music Prize Awards. Um, and it is Wolf Alice, My Love Is Cool. Um, I bought this recently because um, one of my friends is really into them and I've heard a lot of their stuff on the radio. Um, one of their singles is um, Bros and um, it's sort of like sort of rocky, poppy, grunge um, sort of music and um, I think they're a really amazing band and they're fronted by a female, um, which I, just, I kind of really like that in a band where it's sort of, it's sort of the same as... Uh, churches and Paramore, I think it really sticks out and it makes it really amazing that um, you know, females fronting bands is something that is kind of really special in my eyes I think. So that's Wolf Alice, uh, My Love Is Cool. So that's the end of another video, I really hope you enjoyed my CD vinyl collection haul. I'm really sorry it seemed kind of short and rushed um, but I think I'm running out of memory but um, if you want me to do any other reviews, if you've got any requests, please put them down here in the comments and let me know what you think. 
rate, comment and subscribe as always. I really love hearing from you. Thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you guys in another video very soon. Bye!